What is up everybody? It's your boy Prince Truth here. Welcome back to the channel and back to another episode of WWE 2K20 Universe Mode. I got some SmackDown for you guys. But Prince, it's Monday. Yeah, okay. Look, I'm gonna just be straight up with you guys. I've been going through a lot recently. Um like I emotionally. So <laughs> I haven't been doing anything. I haven't been able to get the uh, motivation to do a stream. I haven't even really been playing my PlayStation much. I mean, er every now and again I'll play with my friends and stuff, but like I just I I couldn't get the motivation to do anything. So the only reason my PlayStation's been on m this week is really to do. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was watching TV. I have like Hulu and YouTube, and I uh, was on there just watching YouTube and watching stuff on Hulu. Uh, and NXT got canceled this week because when I went to yeah, <laughs> when I went to um. Do NXT, sorry, I'm really sidetracked. It's it's uh, midnight here. I'm not tired, but I'm just kind of like, it's been a long day. It's been a really long day. Um, when I went to do NXT, I hit options instead of share to start my stream on my controller. And if you look down there, right below the, right below announce cash in, it says edit show for triangle and simulate his options. I hit options and simulated NXT. So that NXT just pretty much just didn't count for anything. And I will be getting you guys NXT next week. No, this week because it is Monday. I'm just going to go ahead. I'm going to try and record Raw as well. But we'll see where that goes. If I don't record Raw tonight, I'll definitely record it tomorrow. But I'm trying to get some NXT in for you guys. I'm not, ugh, some evil within in for you guys because after I beat that I'm going to do Cold Wars campaign because you guys wanted to see some Call of Duty so I'm going to be playing some Call of Duty for you guys but without further ado I'm going to go ahead and go through the matches with you guys and get started on with the show in our opening contest we have Killing Joke taking on Ivar Butterfly taking on Ruby Riot that's the Smackdown Women's Champion Butterfly in this match is a number one contenders match winners will be facing Prince Truth and Alex Strano for the SmackDown Tag Team Championships at Fast Lane. We have Kofi Kingston and Big E of the New Day taking on a Akum and Rezar. Rezar and Akum. Akum and Rezar. We'll be taking on a of AOP. A and they and the third team is Heavy Machinery, Otis and Tucker. The winners of this match will be facing Prince Truth and Alex Strano at Fast Lane. I just said that, didn't I? Oh, it's whatever. You guys, I can just remind y'all. I'll just say it like 27 times. But at that point, you're probably just like skipping the video unless you're watching live. <laughs> you have Phoenix and Shayna Baszler of the Queens, the women's tag team champions, will be taking on the Bella Twins. Alexa Bliss and Ronda Rousey. Samoa Joe and Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens will be facing the Fiend Bray Wyatt at Fastlane for the. World Heavyweight title. And we will be seeing the Lucha House Party, Kalisto and Lince Dorado, who I think have worked out their issues with taking on two members of the bar, Prince Truth and Cesaro. So let's go ahead and get this show on the road to WrestleMania, because we're, we're approaching it. We're on it right now. We had the Royal Rumble. How are we doing, everybody? Welcome to SmackDown. We have a great show packed for you guys, but you guys already saw the card. We're coming at you live from Mobile, Alabama. If you guys are having a great time tonight, we will be getting started as soon as possible. Matter of fact, our match is 
about to be getting underway of the our first match of the evening. I forgot the Toronto entrances and that I aren't, don't need to be on, but we have Killing Joke taking on Ivar. <laughs> After this match, I'll exit and then go fix the entrances I don't need to be on. Very cut for Bell. Match is underway. Killing Joke has actually been very impressive recently. He drops Ivar across the back. He picked up Ivar like Ivar was nothing. Phoenix is down here playing with my uh, feet. Uh, I'm not going to pick her up. She seems to be having a good time. <laughs> having a good time, Phoenix? Killing Joke picking up Ivar. Oh, I'm picking up a little bit more. Killing Joke not slowing down for nothing. Hit. Oh, I thought he was looking for a neck breaker. Oh my gosh, a wicked strike, but not letting Ivar catch a break. But Ivar starting to fire back here. And a clown versus a Viking. Coming off the ropes, uppercut dropping Killing Joke. Went for a big boot, was unsuccessful. Forearm to the spine. Dropping him on his head. Wicked clothesline. Laying in strikes and stomps. You know, these guys never stay in the ring. I decided to say something. He sends Killing Joke back into the ring. For a stomp. Was unsuccessful. We're on to the midsection. Seems like they don't know what they're doing. <laughs> but Ivar has Killing Joke in the corner. And throws him. Ivar staying on Killing Joke. What's Killing Joke going to do? Just going to sit here and take this? Uh, let's him out. <laughs> just wrench it on that neck. And then face first right into the mat. Ivar gloating. And then throws Joke into the ropes. Oof. Knee to the face. And for a kick. Killing Joke. Quickly into a wicked power bomb. Forearm to the back of the head. Come all the way down, but that time it did. Ivar could be getting weak here as Killing Joke stays on the attack. Punch to the face, dropping Killing. Sorry, dropping Ivar. I, I always mix up names, and sometimes I'll say matches of people that aren't even in the match. Went for an uppercut. Discus forearm. Super kick. Right to the face. Killing Joke rolls away. Shorter tackle. Easily dropping Ivar. I'm surprised at how much strength Killing Joke is showing here tonight. Wrenches on that arm. But Ivar firing back and is dropping him. That could be the end of the match. That kick's pretty effective. And Ivar takes the win. Well, he looks freaking nuts. He just... <laughs> driving me on the wall. You can like not, my man. War, 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 war. I'm gonna exit real quick. And deal with the entrances. Watch them all be the just the way that I need them. Uh, entrance is on for this one. I actually think Butterfly still has her SmackDown t-shirt on. If it, if it, I don't know if she does. I'm, I'm turning it off. 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 I need a set of Phoenix and Shayna's entrance. Um. Off. 
off. Off. Phoenix. Hey, Phoenix. Hey. Now move. Move. She don't care. Oh, okay, she cares. <laughs> you come up here and say hi to everybody. Say hi. Say hi, everybody. Hit that follow button. Become a become a knight. Hit that subscribe button and turn on those push notifications if you're watching on YouTube. Turn off the entrances mainly because I don't know if but I don't know if I fixed Butterfly's the tire yet. She was at Survivor Series and she has SmackDown shirt on. Referee Kosher Bell matches underway. Butterfly and Ruby Riot. Butterfly with a gut buster. Ruby Riot dropping. I mean, getting dropped on her head. I don't know why I try. I don't even know why I stream why I do YouTube. I'm obviously ass at it. Nope, rolls through, gets a hold of Butterfly, and taking her down. Looking for a kick was unsuccessful. Ruby sending her off the ropes, picks her up, dropping her right on her back. And my stream is buffering. Absolutely wonderful. Oh, kick to the leg. And Ruby Riot dropping the champion. Nice super kick. Butterflies. A little groggy. And then an uppercut to the head. Nice. Nice takedown. Cover from Butterfly. Just a one count. Punch to the face. Ruby was a little rocked. Into the corner. Knee to the face. Oh, oh, how's her locked up? How's her locked up? I mean, my neck edge. The champion fighting out. Getting up quickly. Sweeping out the legs. Picking up Ruby Riot. Again, sweeping out the legs. Riot looked like she was about to fire back. Butterfly stomping away. What was this? Butterfly saying, let's go. That's I think, I think that's Lena's, Lena Vega. But Butterfly not going <laughs> to let the, let the get the best of her. And sweeping out the legs again. Dropping Ruby Riot on the face. Butterfly has control over Ruby. And Ruby fighting back. Nice Enziguri dropping Butterfly into a cover. Nice two counts. And Butterfly kicks out. Stomp to the arm. The first super kick. Butterfly sidesteps. Kick to the midsection. Nice German suplex. A kick to the spine. Butterfly looking for a win, but Ruby Riot able to easily kick out. I don't know, but I don't know what Ruby was trying to do there, but she obviously fails. Drop kick from Butterfly. Picks up. Ruby, and Ruby not going to let Butterfly get anything over her. Nice forearm. Arm bar, but you got the ankles on the ropes there. 
Butterfly. Brain Buster. Uh, I think Butterfly is just trying to confuse her. Sometimes Butterfly will do that and her, her opponent will go nuts. She went to attack the me. Nice takedown from Ruby Riot. Ruby Riot is sending up top. Let's try to. Turns butterfly around, goes up, down. Oh, attacking the face. Kick to the midsection. Oh, wait, 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 we could be seeing the end of the match here. Butterfly with a butterfly caught neck breaker. Butterfly takes that W. As if there was any doubt. Ruby Ryan, she put up, she did put up a good fight. She really did. Here is your winner, the queen. Or, or butterfly. On to the next match. Alrighty, um, I won. I was gonna play as the New Day. But something's making me want to play is uh, the uh, the heavy machinery. Make me want to play as heavy machinery. Uh, I'm gonna play as I'm gonna play as Otis. Big Geek picks up Otis, but Otis. Fires back. Now I'm gonna be trying to follow this match as much as I can, but there's a lot happening in the ring. So forgive me. But Big E just got thrown. Akam went after Otis, and Otis just dropping Akam, Tucker, and Kofi Kingston. I think Rizar just went after uh, Otis. I don't know if Otis realized. I think Rizar just accidentally hit his tag team partner. Akum gets a hold of Otis and drop in Akum. Biggie went to pick up Otis again, but uh, that was unable to. I'm not sure what just happened there. There's a lot going on. It's going to be really hard to follow this match. Rezar gets just back body drop. Biggie's a little incapacitated on the outside. Akum just biding his time, not really getting involved in any matches. I mean, he could try to help his tag team partner, but you know, I'm not him, so I can't really make any judgment calls. Kofi Kingston trying to get his bearings back. Oh, <laughs> Biggie went, just took a shot at Tucker. Like it looked like Akum was pissed about it. Like, hey, fuck you, dude. Can people stop? T can people just stay on one person? Belly to belly from Otis. Big E planning Otis before the chop to the. Oh, punch from Big E! I can't follow this match, guys. I'm so sorry. <laughs> if I wasn't playing it, maybe, but I'm playing it, so. No, it wasn't playing in this match would take forever. The Otis throwing Big E. Knee driven right down to the canvas. Punch to the midsection. 
Picks up Big E. Big E dropped on his back. Otis and Reza are kind of teaming up against Big E here. Don't let that fool you. Oof. Headbutt to the back. It's funny. Otis and Rezar was kind of teaming up. But we're going at it. But here we are. Otis. Slamming down Rezar. Looking for that win. And I don't know what Akum, Akum just turned on some type of ability. Otis has control over Rezar. Rezar's in a bad predicament here. I see Otis kind of attacked his partner, but I think it was for the best. Kobe gets dropped and so does Rezar. I'm sorry, Akum, that's Akum. Rezar is on the outside. What, Phoenix? What's wrong? You're fine. Cross body. Echo gets picked up and then dropped by Otis. Headbutt from Rezar. All these men want the tag team champion. You know Prince Truth and Alexander are watching this match right now. Prince Truth is in, that, in, in action in the main event tonight. I wasn't even targeted on the right person, so thank God he kicked out. And dropped! Echo. All these supernatural things that came after those creatures showed up from other dimensions. Nice elbow. I've never seen him do that before, though. That was a horrible time to go for a pin. <laughs> Looks like Rezar tried to pick up Otis. Kofi Kingston in a bad predicament here. Belly to back suplex. <laughs> belly to belly for Modus. Turning his attention back to Big E. Looking to go to fast lane. Heavy machinery takes the win. I don't think Rezar really uh, noticed what was going on there. Heavy machinery is going to fast lane to challenge the bar. I was going to include the Lucha House Party, but I'm not sure if they fully worked out their issues. We'll find out later tonight. But up next, we have the Women's Tag Team Champions, the Queens, taking on the Bella Twins. Well, 
Could you load any slower? Pro actually, I probably shouldn't say that. <laughs> Mickey and Shayna Baylor starting this match off. And quickly, Shayna. Running in knees. I don't think Nikki Bell was, ex was expecting that. The Bell Twins have been chasing these titles for a while. First it was with the Iconics, but now it's Shayna and Phoenix who have a different attitude to the Iconics. A very different attitude. Shayna went to take down Nikki, but Nikki, I think, may, may have sidestepped her. Nice. Nikki fighting back to the corner. Top to the chest, but Shayna fires back. Hits a wicked kick. Stomp right to the chest. Forearm to the face. Kicked another kick to the face. Picking up Sh Nikki and dropping her on her back. Kicked. Oh, oh no no no! Nice elbow. Again, strike. Dragon screw. These two are going very back and forth here. And the Bell Twins really want to prove themselves. Oh, kick to the head. May have knocked down Nikki. Oh, maybe I spoke to soon. Nikki gets right back up. Taking down Shayna. I'm about, I'm about to say Nikki gets to get out of there. She does tag in Brie Bella. And Shayna was a quick one-legged drop kick. But Brie able to easily kick out. Picking up Brie immediately. You know, Shayna is going to quickly pick apart Brie. Nice shot from Brie. Kick to the face. Nikki went to attack the leg. But unfortunately, Shayna has control. I don't know what my voice just did there. Roll. Shayna into a cover. But Nikki Bella, I'm sorry, Brie Bella able to easily kick out her twins. I'm sorry, I messed them up a little bit. Oh, into dropping out. But Brie gonna quickly try to fight out of this. Realize the danger she was in. Oh. Tagging in a huge fan favorite, Phoenix. Coming in and coming in strong. Phoenix Factor. Nice fireman's carry from Bree. Bree hits a drop kick. And tagging out. And here comes her sister, Nikki. It's a smart move on the Bella Twin side. Take it down. Phoenix, kick to the spine. Nice takedown. Went to put Nikki on the mat. So another sidestep. Three. Sorry, Nikki refusing to stay down. But Phoenix is going to make it happen one way or another. The Phoenix up top. We've seen the ending of this match. The Phoenix splash. And Brie comes in to break it up. She hurt. But I don't know. Well, maybe she just knew Phoenix too well. Phoenix not done with Bree. Coming in, strong with her leg drop, but Nikki was able to move out of the way. 
Well, has her up. Face first into the mat. Phoenix could be slumped there. No, Phoenix easily kicking out. And Phoenix fighting back. Neck breaker. Kick to midsection. Phoenix Factor. And Phoenix looked like she was going to try and attack Bree, but just, just gave up on it. Phoenix trying to pick her spot, but she better move quickly. Phoenix again. Phoenix Splash connects. What distance, what airtime she had. Stomp to the arm. Nikki being very resilient. Phoenix quickly with an elbow right to the knee. Little foot stomp. Drop. Ace. Another drop kick. Throwing Mickey. Mickey's not doing too well. But she's just staying in the fight. I don't know how wise that is on her part on the ropes. I don't know if that was pure instinct or sheer luck. Phoenix goes up and taken down Nikki. Why would you turn around? You, we're about to do a Phoenix Splash. You're about to turn back around anyway. <laughs> Into a cover. Phoenix came in. And I thought Phoenix was going to put the match away quickly, but that's not the case. That airtime was impressive. If things get more speed, the longer they get to take to the ground. I'm surprised Nikki was able to catch out of that. Alexa Bliss and Ronda Rousey. I'll be playing this match as Alexa Bliss. Because, you know, I like Alexa Bliss and I don't like Ronda Rousey at all. You can stay gone. Alexa Bliss and Ronda. Alexa Bliss quickly dropping Ronda. For a kick, Ronda sidesteps. Hold of the back. Kick to the back of the knee. Going up, reverse DDT. Kick to the spine. Hi, hello, how are you? Welcome to the round table. Kick to the midsection. Suplex from Alexa Bliss. Stop in Ronda Rousey. Double axe handle to the head. Ronda, it looked like it didn't really affect Ronda. Lifting the knee right to the face, right to the midsection. Ooh, kick to the skull. Alexa Bliss is slumped. Ooh, laying in like heavy strikes. Went for a straight front kick, but was unable to. 
Alexa Bliss, nope. I don't know what Alexa Bliss was trying to do there. Probably what I was trying to make her do that she can't do. <laughs> nice kick to the chest from Bliss. Take down from Rousey. Straight front kick again. Maybe you should stop that, Rousey. Because that's not working out too well. Drop kick dropping Rousey. Looks to Bliss up top. Oh. Oh. I feel Alexa's pain. That front kick ain't working for you, Ronda. You should probably stop. You know, all about that kick. Prince Truth uses it. <laughs> Not very often, but he does. He does use it. Alexa Bliss keeping her distance. That time it connects. Ronda has control over Alexa Bliss. Alexa Bliss fighting back. Get to midsection. Brock Cutter looked like taken down Ronda Rousey. Up, oh, insulted injury. Bliss looking for that win over Rousey. And Rousey easily kicks out it too. Alexa Bliss heading up top. Twisted Bliss. Just a two count on Zillions. Alexa Bliss firing, sweeping out the legs. Why, Phoenix? Really? Okay. Uh, you have a fair point. I think Phoenix just farted. <laughs> yeah, I'm, ta I'm talking about you. It's not like she said, oh, okay. And she walking, she walking away too. Sorry to put your business out there. But Alexa Bliss and Ronda Rousey. In this match, up goes up. Control of a Rousey, nice catching her off guard into a cover, but she's able to kick out. Alexa Bliss, though, not gonna sit back. Quickly attacking Ronda Rousey off that pin. Oh man, you see that Alexa Bliss is tired. Can you shut up? <laughs> You're getting annoying, Phoenix. Alexa Bliss is tired. Yeah. She is, Phoenix. One, two, three. Hi, Phoenix. Alexa Bliss takes that win. On to the next match. Up next, we have Samoa Joe and Kevin Owens. I will is Owens because he's the number one contender. I don't want him to look weak. I don't want Kevin Owens to beat the Fiend, but I don't want him to look weak going into Fastlane. You feel me? Super kick early on. No one's think that's it. He had that super kick. It looked like he was done. With that easy. Let's see. You just got clothesline because you want to get cocky. Up goes Owens. Oh, Owens taking down Samoa Joe into an early cover. Oh, oh no. Samoa Joe thought about it. 
uh, the takedown Owens but Owens not able to get the full connection close line cover again another early cover that was a wicked close line from Kevin Owens though Pushing down the foot into Samoa Joe. Close line. Hold on, let me move Phoenix's food. She's about to knock it over. For a suplex. Knee to the face. For a kick, Kevin Owens not gonna let that be his fate. No, 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 not today. He says, Pump handle caught though. He's dropping Samoa Joe into a cover, just a two count. Driving the boot into the midsection of Samoa Joe. I don't know what the fans were just now saying, what the WWE Universe was just saying. But no matter what they were saying, this match is still continuing. Attacking the jaw. Kick to the midsection. Clothesline. Referee. Got caught in the crossfire. Mojo picking up Owens. Dropping him into a pin. Kicking out. Fans. WWE Universe is loving this match. Kevin Owens. Fighting out of it. That came out of nowhere. WWE Universe. Loving these two. And I, I, I could watch these two go head to head every week. Probably shouldn't say that because the game won't make that happen. But Owens, wait, Owens had a stutter. And he takes the W here tonight. Okay. I'm not Dutch the controller. <laughs> that pump handle. Oh, we'll see it from a different different angle. You can see that Samoa Joe's head just landed on the knee. Kevin Owens. But that wasn't it. This right here, I was a little worried for Kevin Owens. He 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 did kick out. Oh, I'm showing this again. He he kicked out, and Samoa Joe put him into a Boston Crab. He was able to get out, and then get the win. I think Owens realized the danger that he was in. Let's see how many more matches I have. I feel like I haven't been doing this this long though. <laughs> it's one in the morning. Jeez. Oh, we have one more match. Well, it did take me a minute to get everything set up, and I had to take care of a few things. Now, I wasn't, I was going to fix this so there were no managers on the outside because, you know, how tag team matches are. But since I'm playing this match, I don't think it's that big of an issue. But tag team matches with managers, they are rolling out the ring, and I get irritated. I mean, I get irritated with tag team matches regardless, which is why, you know, I, it wasn't my choice to put Prince Truth on the tag team <laughs> or in a faction. It just kind of happened. Match is underway. Lindsay and Cesaro. Nice chop to the chest. Cesaro with a suplex to Lindsay. Leg drop across the, 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 back, uh, the, the chest. Yeah. 
Looking for a chop. Oh, into the corner. Ooh, uh, ooh. Something like that happened last week. Here comes Prince Truth. Just drop kick to the both of them. Referee telling him to get out of the ring. Cesaro coming back in. Yeah, Kalisto is a little incapacitated. He shouldn't be out for that long. Cesaro firing shots back. Lince can't get his head in the game. Well, I thought, I thought maybe Cesaro was gonna. It looked like he had a hold of the mask. I thought he was about to rip it off of Lince's face. That would just be absolute dick, dick move. That's what they do in WWE to make the villain like the bad guy look like an absolute piece of shit. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to be a heel? Or do you like being a face? Do you like being a face? I don't even know what you are right now, Phoenix. Your team was Shayna Baszler. You know, you never, you never really know, though. A nice takedown from Cesaro. Kind of just forced the boot down. I guess you could say that he put his boot down. Put his foot down? Put his foot down. So because of the time, I'm probably going to be trying to go to sleep in like an hour. So... I'll do Raw tomorrow. I, I, I apologize. Cesaro looking for a win. Oh, just a two count. Kalisto gets up. Taking down Cesaro. Cesaro has been taking apart Lince Dorado single handedly. Cesaro locking up Lince. He can see Kalisto. What is, why, where's Prince Truth? What is Prince Truth doing? You're gonna stop Kalisto. <laughs> Elbow to the back of Lindsay. Cover. And Kalisto tried to come in and save it. Prince Truth didn't even have to compete tonight. Lucky guy. Lucky guy. I don't know how y'all feel about that. However, I know y'all all like Phoenix a lot more than the Prince. You know, that's, you know, that's totally fair. She's adorable. I'm not. I thought I was. But apparently. Here are your winners, the Prince and Cesaro, the Bar. No one really roared out of the ring during the match. I don't know. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys. I do thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys ever missed anything and want to catch up on everything, head over to my YouTube channel at Prince Truth Not There. And if you haven't done already, hit that subscribe button and put the notifications so you never miss an episode. Hit the follow button to become a knight today, and I will see you guys in the next one. Until then, guys, I am out.